by Kurt Weill is going to be played a half step down. What that means is that you're going to detune your guitar. Your sixth string gets tuned down to a D sharp. Your fifth string gets detuned to a G sharp. Your fourth string goes down to a C sharp. Your third string goes down to an F sharp. Your second string goes down to an A sharp. And your first string goes down to a D sharp. So we've taken this uh, whenever we're playing standard chords or playing them at a tone one half step lower than what the nut is usually tuned at. Um, I couldn't find any videos of Kurt Weill playing this song, so I'm having to speculate as to what his fingerings are, but the first chord of the song is definitely this. I don't know the fingerings he's using to play it, but I'm using my first finger on the 6th string, 3rd fret, pinky finger on the 5th string, 5th fret, and then I'm using my ring finger on the 4th string, 4th fret. This whole song is finger picked, by the way. So the opening chord... I'm using my thumb to pluck string 6 and 5, and then I'm using my first finger for string 4, my second finger for open string 3, first finger back to 4, thumb down to 5, and then thumb repeating that back to the G. So that's the first chord. And the run stops right there on the fifth string. The second chord. That. I'm going with my second finger, it's essentially a C, but I'm going with my second finger to the fifth string, third fret, first finger to the fourth string, second fret, and I'm using my thumb for the fifth string, my first finger for the fourth string, and then I'm using my second finger to pluck the open second string, and then my first finger to pluck the open third string. So we've got first round of it, the second round of it, on the C, the striking of strings two and three doubles. So instead of just one strike on each and then back in the G, the second time through each other, or every other time through, you're doubling your strikes. And that's coming together very slowly like this. bridge of the song we've got to change it goes is the first movement so out of the C chord where we've got our second finger and first fingers where we had them before you're going to pluck the fifth and fourth strings and then with your pinky go to the third string fifth fret and then you'll bring your pinky down one fret to the fourth fret of the third string and then you'll open up the third string so you've got In between the uh, third string fifth fret and third string fourth fret, it sounds like Kurt Vial goes back to his thumb and just hits the C note of the fifth string, like, and then open up the third string. And then we've got the way that you're going to do that is put your uh, second finger on the fourth string second fret, ring finger on the third string second fret, and you'll pluck the open five, the fretted four, and the fretted three. So I'm going thumb first second, and then take your second and ring finger and just move them down one set of strings. So now your second finger is on the fifth string, um, fifth string second fret, and ring finger is on the fourth string second fret. And you do the same picking pattern with your right hand, thumb first second. Now your second finger is hitting the open third string. So thumb on the five, second on the four. Uh, or thumb on the five, first on the four, second on the three string. So we've got. And the second time through, that part repeats, and now we go. So the same part of the riff as before, but then after you hit the one, two, three, you're going to hit the open second string come back to the fretted third string 
and then with your second finger slide it up to the fourth string fourth fret and then hit the open third string behind it so you've got and then it repeats back into through it goes the way that you want to do that is you'll uh, you'll keep your second and ring fingers inside of this A position you'll hit the open fifth string and then you will uh, lift up your ring finger hit the open third string and hammer on with your ring finger to the third string second fret and then immediately hit the open second string and then come back to the fret of third string and then with your pinky put your pinky down on the first string third fret hit that slide your pinky down one fret to the first string second fret hit that then open up the first string hit that then put your pinky down on the second string third fret hit that then pick your pinky up open up the second string hit that and then you're going to come back to where your second finger is still at on the third string second fret hit that and then lift up your second finger and open up the third string so you've got and then it goes right back into the So the first time is just the second time the third time the fourth time and it does that for a long time until eventually uh, out of one of these it stops on the where your second finger is out on the fourth string second fret and just lingers there before going back into the G chord up to the C chord G chord C chord G chord C chord G chord C chord So those are the chords and movements and the riffs to this Kurt Vile song. Hopefully that gives you an idea of how to approach it.